Thank you, Nicola. Can anyone take the fight to Davy Todd? Here we go. Connor Cummins just to the back of this picture as well. As Davy Todd already sprints out into an early lead. He is odds on favourite for this one. Second wave gets away. Number 23. That's Marcus Simpson. Into Robert's Connor Herbertson up the inside, perhaps taking the inside line. Certainly different lines going in. Looking back from Michael Sweeney. Certainly a couple of lines going into Robbo's, but only one line around it, really. Let's watch the start again. Looking back from Dominic Herbertson. As we just see Michael Sweeney filling the picture. Good start from Connor Cummins. He's not been here for 11 years, remember. Oh, just gets a little bit tight, but just managed to get ahead of Paul Jordan. Church bends, Davy Todd pulling away. Bill Crow into second position. Jamie Coward's also up there. So too Dominic Herbertson. Michael Sweeney. There goes Herbertson past Sweeney. Great to see Michael Sweeney racing again. Oh ho! Davy Todd flying. They ride the waves down into Bellaney Cross. And you just know that Davy Todd under that helmet has a broad smile across his face. Back with Dominic Herbertson. That was a great move to go past Michael Sweeney and move up into fourth position. But Todd across the line again. Extending that lead out in front. Phil Crow, a very solid second place ahead of Jamie Coward. It's game on for fourth between Herbertson and Sweeney. Brown trying to get involved as well. Connor Cummins would like a piece of that as well. So we're at the halfway point in this race. And that gap this time around, seven seconds between Todd and Phil Crow. Oh, no, 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 no. Mike Brown just too hot into the turn. He's recovered it superbly, it has to be said. But Mike Brown just too hot coming into Robbo's. Paul Jordan's passed Connor Cummins, by the way. I don't know whether Connor was reacting to Mike Brown. But we're riding with Davy Todd. Here we go on the BMW. Just watch this. <laughs> Feet on the pegs. Front wheel in the air. Moving that back wheel around. Yeah, Davy Todd's having a great time here at Armoy this weekend. So too the fans who've turned up today. And many will be disappointed. There's no Michael Dunlop here, of course. However, Davy Todd is putting on a display that they'll remember for a mighty long time to come. So too many of these other riders. The Connor Cummins. Great to see him back racing again. Really good to see him back racing again, in fact. He's learning his way around Armoy again and also his way around on a new machine to him. Armoy this weekend, so too the fans who've turned up today. And many will be disappointed. There's no Michael Dunlop here, of course. However, Davy Todd is putting on a display that they'll remember for a mighty. Jamie Coward still in third place on the Honda behind Phil Crow, maybe not. A mistake this time by Crow. He manages to hang on to second place. However, it's game on for second place now. And Coward is going to take full advantage. You would see him. Oh, no. Crow just manages to squirt it back on as they power down towards Church Benz. So having broken the lap record, Davy Todd looks as if he's going to take a race victory here at Armoy. The Art of Man Senior TT winner on the British circuits. He's leading the National Superstock Championship. It is certainly turning out to be a year to remember for Todd. And we've still, of course, got the Armoy Race of Legends to come later on. And you wouldn't bet against him doing the, the double on the superbikes here at Armoy. My goodness. You just hope, really, that uh, 
one of the third wave riders. <laughs> oh my goodness me, Phil Crow just finding the gap to go through. I was going to suggest maybe you don't want them influencing who finishes second and who finishes third. That was Don McFadden. Here comes Todd to cross the line in first place. What a result, what a performance and a stoppy, a customary stoppy as well from Mr Todd. It will be Phil Crow in second from Jamie Coward. Mike Brown fighting and trying to take the position, but not quite uh, snatching it from Michael Sweeney at the chequered flag. Congratulations, Davy Todd. I think to say he and the fans thoroughly enjoyed that one. Confirmation of the results there. Mike Brown in sixth, just behind Sweeney. Dominic Herbertson fourth, Jamie Coward third, Phil Crow second, and Davy Todd, the race winner. Davy, congratulations. Uh, you're in some form today. Felt awesome, honestly, just enjoying myself every lap. Seeing all the spectators waving us on again out there, it's a, it's a really special feeling to to have everybody cheer you on like that. So feels really cool, and it, it's nice to be here at Amoy.